What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. I am driving while filming. Big mistake. Don't do this. Do not do this. But today, we're going to this Target right here, and we're going to see if we can find some legends. My boy Michael put me on here, so I'm going to see if we can go in here and find some stuff, man. Got to get a park, and then we'll go in and see what we got. See what they got. Oh snap. Oh snap. Let's go. We got Hogan. We got plenty of Hogan. Got some top pick Cena. Okay, Fatu, Fatu. Not the chase. We're cooking. We got Bradshaw. Okay, Fatu again. Okay, okay, okay. Is that it though? Is that it? Is that it? Plenty of Dingo Warrior. AJ Styles, AJ Styles, AJ Styles. Night Jax. Lots of Cena. Wait, sorry, these have been here for a year and a half. Uh, take out. Got Jeff. Jeff. No way. Let's go. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's see, let's see. AJ Styles. Ultimate Edition. How beautiful. It's like so quiet in here. I feel so awkward, but. Got another one? Okay. Got three of them. Wow. Maybe somebody was trying to hide them behind the Jeff Hardys. I think these Jeff Hardys are on clearance, though, to be honest. Okay, so I'm missing, what, Samu and Polly Dangerously. Oh, no, I'm not. We got Polly Dangerously. Let's go. How many they got here? We got Topic Slashley. Still a cool find right there. Okay, so they have lots of Polly Dangerously one, too. Okay, they got the old WrestleMania shipper deal. And then, I think that's it though, but they have lots of Polly. Topics Bobby. Topics Rollins, I actually need one, but I don't know. Uh, if they were 50% off, maybe. Two AJs. Everybody was Samu. Dang, oh. I went to my Target by my house this morning. They didn't have anything, even though it said they had them in the back, but I may have to go get a cart or a, a little hand grab deal because uh, I need to um, I'm not going to be able to carry all this I'm not going to stack all this like this I need to go get one of the little hand carts I don't know why my mind's going blank but what else we got the Marvel Legends group pretty cool I think that's my second time seeing that did I hate talking in there when there's like nobody here Feel very, very awkward. Very awkward. I hate it. So I always talk low on toy hunts, so I apologize, but Adam Warlock, a Star Lord. My target had all of them, but I found Miles Morales. I'll show you guys in the hall, but that's all I found. My target had like nine of them. I don't see anything else. Jesus, so quiet. Despise it. Just need to learn how to yell in here. Don't see anything else though, but I gotta leave the goods for now. You think anybody will get it? If somebody comes and gets it, then I guess I just wasn't meant to get them, but I think. Oh yeah, huge shout out to my man Michael for making it known that these were here. So huge shout out to my buddy, but I guess I'm gonna go get a shopping cart deal. Not a whole, I don't want the buggy. I just want the basket. That's the damn word. A basket. Couldn't think of basket. Shaking my head. All right, got my basket. Jesus. I can always remember what aisle it is because it has this pole. Oh, that was embarrassing. It has this pole running all the way up through it, but all right, goods are still here. Still missing Razor, still missing Brett, but this is still a W. Wet morning, but that's a W right there, fellas. We're still missing Samu, though. Gonna have to find and track that down, but I'd still chalk it up as a W today, this morning, and we'll we'll live with it, so good stuff. 
All right, man, we are back home after the toy hunt, and now I can finally show you guys what we picked up. Also, I'm going to go ahead and show off what I picked up over the, the weekend in L.A., what we got at WrestleMania. So Mattel did hook us up with some cool stuff. I did get this Elite 100 poster, and unfortunately, I had no way to take this. I'd had no room on my carry-on. I had no room anywhere in my bag. So I had to pack this thing up and it made it, I mean, pretty unscathed. I mean, it's definitely not perfect condition anymore, but it actually looks a whole lot better than I thought it would given all the, the travels that that poster went through right there. Also, while at the Superstore, I went ahead and picked up both versions of the Dolph Ziggler Basic. I grabbed the pink version and the blue version. You know, I was right there. And also, I needed a clear bag to leave out of the Superstore so I could put all my stuff in it. So I was like, you know what, bro? I'm right here. I might as well get my boy Dolph Ziggler. So I picked up the blue and the pink. And, you know, we got my boy represented over there, which is really nice. So these will probably... I don't know what I'll do with these. They'll definitely probably go in the, you know, in the crowd or something like that. But also... We could use the head sculpts potentially at a later date or something like that. So I did grab those two figures right there. Uh, also, I got my uh, my Mattel lanyard here from them when I went to visit. Really, really cool there. They also gave me a WrestleMania 39 hat. Need to clean it up a little bit again. All this stuff I had no room for in my bag, man. So I had to like cram it in there, which is really unfortunate. But you know, it is what it is. Also, we got this from Mattel, which was su uh, such a nice gesture, man. I appreciate them so very much. This figure looks incredible. The Tory Wilson Ruthless Aggression figure. And uh, again, I had to pack this thing up in my bag. I had no room, so it definitely got damaged, but I was going to open it anyways. Really excited for the Tory Wilson figure. I'll probably review that in a quick video or something like that later down the line. We also got the Elite 100 Rey Mysterio. And we're actually giving this away on the Patreon page. It actually got dented up as well, but I'm going to ship it off just like this if you guys want to keep it. Or I guess the, the winner of the giveaway, you can pick. You want it loose, you want it mock, that'll be up to you. But we did also get that figure. We also got a clear bag that I didn't even know they included until like I got home or when I was packing up to go home. And they also threw in the retro four pack, the orange version. So I, I can't remember. I think it's like Luger and Doink and them. That is the pack we have there. Might also give that away on Patreon as well. I didn't really get an opportunity to show this off in the, you know, in the interview with Mattel, but I also made a custom MDT mic for like interviews and stuff like that. So this is really fun. I, I had a ton of fun making this and getting this going. It's just completely custom made. So that was a really cool piece. And uh, I don't know, it's, it's part of the channel history now. So I'm, I'm going to use this for interviews moving forward. I thought the audio sounded good. So we'll roll with that. Now, these came in over Mania Weekend while I was gone, but I also got the animated Spider-Man 2-pack with Spider-Man and Carnage. I want to get a loose set, or I may use these as my loose set. I'm not entirely sure just yet, but I picked up that. I got four of the Toby Spider-Man SH figure arts there. That's one of them, so I have four of those. I, I, I just wanted to go all in on those, so I'm excited to have those. And then we also have the Iron Spider SH figure arts figure here, which I'm really excited to unbox on those. I want to do a full review on this. I don't know if that'll come to fruition or not. So we will have to, you know, that all remains to be seen, but did get those Spider-Man figures, lots of Spider-Man stuff going on. And then we have our pickups from what we got on today's toy hunt. The first thing that we got was an Ultimate Edition AJ Styles. So excited for this figure. I, again, if I, I left one behind, but it may be one of those that every time I see it, if I have an opportunity, if I have the funds, I'm going to buy it. I just think the, the attire is beautiful. The head sculpts are great. The build is great. I, I even posted recently to Instagram about them fixing the Mattel formula for AJ Styles, but we did get that. And not only did we get one, but we also got a second one. So I'll be opening one of these, and then I'll keep the other one on ice. You know, we're still hunting for Bret Hart, still looking for Razor Ramon. We'll definitely find those, but this is what we got. We got to find not only a men on card regular Razor Ramon, we got to find the Chase version as well. So there is AJ Styles. Got two of those. Really excited for that figure. That's one of my favorite Mattels they've done in a while, man. Especially just as an Ultimate Edition, I love that AJ Styles. Outside of AJ, we also picked up the Legends Hulk Hogan. Going to do a full set review on these. Excited to get this one. You know, they did not have Samu, though. So I can't review the full wave until I get that. And I also meant to get an extra Polly Dangerously. Like, I grabbed Fatu, right? I got Fatu. I got Hulk Hogan. 
I got Polly Dangerously, which is a beautiful figure here. But I meant to get a second one for the suited body so I could do like a guy in a suit. I don't know if it was going to be Seth Rollins or Cody or who, but I wanted to do a, a suited body and I didn't do that. But hopefully there'll be plenty to go around. I looked up the UPC code for the Poly Dangerously and it's actually not at my target. They have the rest of them. I went this morning. They didn't have any of them out on the shelf, so they're in the back, but I did not. Uh, this one is not in the system, so I'm guessing my target does not have a Poly Dangerously, so... I don't know what I'll do about that. We'll figure it out. But I uh, actually ended up grabbing some extras. So at my Target, they had the Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse Marvel Legends figures. And just looking at this, it looks beautiful. But dude, for $24.99, you get this figure, a pair of interchangeable hands, an interchangeable head. And just look at the amount of plastic they're using, like how small these figures are. I'm very excited for the film. I love Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, the first movie, you know, all these different things. And I'm excited for this wave. But Jesus, it just looks so bare bones. They had like 10 of them, so I figured I'd cop one. Might cop another one down the line to have, you know, the Miles head sculpt instead of the mast head sculpt, but we'll see. You know, I, I still wanted to pick that up. That looks beautiful. And this right here was the deal of the day, bro. I got this for, I think, 8 bucks or $9. It said that it's usually 30 and it was marked off to 15 I got it for 8 or 9 or it may have been 10 I don't know. But it was super cheap. So this is the Batman's Villains Lair. And the reason I got this is because if you look on the back, it's like this little diorama set. And I figured, I was like, dude, I could like do something with this. You know, I want the Batcave and I want the Villains Lair. They're very cheap right now. I think they're on clearance everywhere. So I'll definitely be using this in some capacity. But that was our toy hunt. I know we showed off a lot more than just what we got on the toy hunt. But... There was a lot to show off, man. So we got the villain's lair. We got all this other crap. Yeah, and now, now that all this is here, I got to clean all this up. But Jesus Christ. Huge shout out to our patrons. I pop up their names because I'm actually editing this on my phone. So I do apologize for that. But a huge shout out to our Patreon members. Link in the description below if you guys want to be a part of that. This package right here is actually for my patron members. So... If you guys are Patreon members, you know what I'm talking about. Nonetheless, man, that's going to wrap up this video. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. Leave me your thoughts down in the comment section below. I'm getting out of here. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at MyDamnToys. Have a blessed one, and I'll see you next time.